Hey everyone, what's going on? Welcome back. This is Alvaro. So guys, today we're actually going to install the actual muffler. So I got all the parts on the side already to uh, put them in there on the car. So we need to go ahead and take off the existing muffler so we can go ahead and get this installed. Let me just show you the parts guys so you can get an idea. <clears throat> so we'll need a 13 millimeter socket for the actual bolts on the exhaust, a 15 for the actual clamps, a 21 and a 24 for the bolts that are gonna be on the leaf where we're gonna add the new hooks for the uh, pipes going to the back. So let's go ahead and get this installed. Right, guys so you see this clamp right here from here all the way back and we're replacing the entire muffler so first muffler down mid pipe second muffler and then the actual tip at the end so we'll start here removing these bolts actual existing muffler sorry there's mosquitoes everywhere so the existing muffler was actually in two pieces only instead of uh, the new one has what one two three about four pieces so this one actually had the first muffler a resonator and then the entire exit of the muffler and and the second muffler as one entire piece so we have to actually wiggle it out of the back of the of the truck uh, the good thing is the new one actually comes into more pieces so it has 
the first piece of the muffler, the mid pipe, the other muffler, and then the actual exit into three pieces. So it's going to be a lot nicer for us to be able to put it in than the way that we were trying to take out the existing one, which was only two pieces. So let's go ahead and get this uh, muffler installed. God dang, there's yeah, a lot of yeah. mosquitoes. Holy crap, man. Bring the light up close to it so you can really see the difference. Look at that. Look at the size on the, the resonator and the difference in the metal. Stainless, stainless steel. The pipe. Look at the size of these mufflers. Stock and the S type. And now we have two exhausts instead of one. Yep. Alright guys, so we started installing the new muffler in there and I instead of starting with the actual uh, resonator I actually started with the muffler because it has a piece that goes over the axle so I put that one in first before putting the actual resonator and then the mid pipe so that way I just finish off with the exit. So let me show you guys how it looked right now with the resonator and the muffler that goes over the axle. Let's see, so here, can you run the light at it? So, here we go. Let's show you here. Let's show them the muffler right there. And then go back so they can see how the pipe goes over the axle. See guys how that pipe goes over the axle. So that piece right there is what we installed first because it made it a lot easier to put in here before we start putting all the other parts. So here goes that actual muffler piece. Here goes the mid pipe. And then, uh, give me some light back here so I can show them the actual resonator back there and then there goes the resonator that we installed with just the two existing bolts that we had back into the actual muffler system of the car so let me go ahead and keep working on it guys and I'll keep showing you as we're going through and completing the installation on the car I mean the truck Um, all right guys, so here's a new bracket that we installed on the leaf bolt right here So here's the bracket. Here's the isolator And then we went ahead and tightened it already. So it's good ready for the actual muffler piece You see it? Yeah, we can see it. Okay, and then we did the same thing on the other, Same thing, but just so they can get the idea So the new bracket here and then the isolator right there ready for the actual pipe so let's go ahead and get that installed and we'll show it to you guys
Hey guys, so when I did the installation, it got, as you can tell, a little dark. So I want to show you guys how it looks right now during the day. And I'm also going to go under there and wherever I have the connections, I'm going to mark it with my little Sharpie just to kind of indicate where the sleeves are. And just that way I can kind of keep track once in a while when I go under there and check and make sure that, you know, they're not slipping off, which I doubt it'll happen. But, you know, just for safe, you know, to be safe, I'm going to go ahead and just mark it wherever the actual... Uh, pipes are, are being fitted. So let's go look. All right, guys. So, hey, thanks for tuning in, guys. Uh, go ahead and once you hear it, let me know what you think. You know, go ahead and comment below. Let me know if you think you like it or if you think we should have gone louder. So, thanks for tuning in again. And make sure you comment, like, and subscribe. Guys, go ahead and hit that bell so you get notified every time I add a new video. All right? See y'all later.